Jimmy, obviously narrow defeat tonight, but the performance was a million miles away from Saturday, wasn't it? Yeah, definitely. We were absolutely gutted in there. Obviously, we wanted to progress. And I feel the chances we had out there, we, we could have, especially in the first half, them set pieces. Goals change games and obviously they've managed to get one and we haven't. In terms of the performance though, you know, from start to finish, like I said, defensively as well, dealing with set pieces was a was a big problem Saturday, but tonight it just feels like completely on its head, like dealt with everything that was thrown at you apart from obviously like you said that quality free kick. Yeah, as well we've we shown out there. We've we've worked on it through through the week. Um and we didn't have much time to do it but and obviously we've changed changed personnel as well, which which I feel like like we did do well out there. Um, obviously Stockport were very good. That's what they're probably best in the league at set pieces. Bradford are very good at them as well. But yeah, we've managed to do that, and it's just disappointing that we we haven't won or come away and took it to pens. Yeah, uh, on an individual basis, obviously back in the lineup tonight after a bit of time out. How did it feel? Full yeah, good. Well. Yeah, the full game. Um, Obviously, I've got so much to work on fitness-wise, so playing catch-up from the start of the season, really. Yeah. But now I'm putting, my, putting myself out there and pushing myself as much as I possibly can. Just on the injury, just give us an update on how it's coming along. Obviously, fully over it now, or you still got yeah, uh, fitness-wise? Yeah, I'm, I'm fully over it. Um, I've trained three, four days now, so feeling good and obviously getting, getting the game in tonight and just need to keep going and I'll keep doing the best I possibly can to, to keep pushing myself. What's it been like not being being able to get involved with games? Watching? Are you a good watcher? Or no, <laughs> terrible. Um, I've done it a lot this season. It's been very hard, um, especially the start of the season. Then just had a little a little problem, but nothing much. And I was training last week, so it's been good. Obviously, like I say, getting getting the run out tonight, and we obviously wanted to 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 come away with a result and progress in the competition. So we're obviously gutted about that and. Personally, yeah, I'm happy to be out on the pitch, but more importantly, I'm gutted that we've lost. And obviously, a few of you back now, James, Richard, come back in, John, yeah. got a few minutes tonight as well. Feels like you're going to be needed as well these last this last third of the season. Yeah, definitely. Like As a squad, it's, it's been tough, especially for the gaffer to choose because I've not really had a consistency in players with the amount of injuries we've had, which I know we can't make an excuse about injuries, but it is what it is, really. We have had bad injuries and... It has affected especially to, to a lot of key players, which is which has been tough. But like I say, as a squad, as a group of players, we've been working as hard as we possibly can and we've just got to keep pushing and go again for the next game, Sutton. I was going to say, Sutton, the, it is a big game. Yeah. So I think they lost tonight. Um, okay. But yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a six-pointer, I suppose, isn't it? Well. Yeah, every game is massive. Obviously, we wanted this game. We wanted to win this game. And now we need to go and win that game. Or at least give ourselves a good, give a good account of ourselves, and keep pushing and keep working on what we can, and hopefully, hopefully we do get a good result. 